another week another upload my name is Angel Zondi and welcome to my YouTube channel If you are a returning subscriber, welcome back, Efem. And if you are new, please make sure that you like, subscribe, comment, and share. I want to know what you think about this video. So today I am going to be showing you how I apply my individual lashes. My journey with individual lashes has been a very bittersweet one. Let me stop there. My journey with individual lashes has been very, very very bittersweet because I've always wanted to do individual lashes and the chance when I got the chance that I got to do them I did not like them they were really expensive and I when I looked at the person that applied them on me and how they did it on me I just thought you know what I can do this myself I literally can do this myself and that is how we ended up doing this tutorial slash how I do things slash just watch the video um, so yeah I'm really excited and um, I'm gonna be showing you how I do individual lashes and it's been quite a journey because I it took some time for me to master it and I think I've mastered it and I'm just gonna be showing you how I do my lashes and trust me this is a lot easier than you think um, it's not as hard as you think it is I thought it was really really hard and that is why I kept going from one one lash take to another lash take to another lash take and I just did not get the results that I wanted and so with this I got the results that I wanted and I can also determine the length and the placement and how I want things to be done starting off with the products that I will be using um, I will be using these lashes from Eyler here they are take a screenshot I will be um, mentioning the prices in the description below so open the tab and check how much they are but I think they are a hundred rand and I got two of them the reason why I got two is because with um, with what I have experienced with individual lashes is that sometimes I just feel like one packet is not enough uh, especially for the size that I want I know that a lot of people like uh, a cat's eye effect which means that they start with short lashes and then medium and then long lashes here at, towards the end of their eye um, I don't like that I just like one size throughout except for here like and then I can get like shorter ones in front and so when you do that you'd find that um, they don't have enough of them because when you look here when you look here the the this box comes in a three different sizes short medium and long and I like to play around with medium and long and sometimes there's just not enough for me to play around and that's why I get two boxes the next product that I like using I like using a clean pair of tweezers here they are make sure that you sterilize them you can sterilize them with sanitizer with anything that has alcohol I know that Domestos also works or bleach or anything like that to so just get rid of any bacteria because we do not want any infection sweetie the last product that I will be using is this glue from Eyler for individual lashes this is how it looks inside as you can see, I prefer using um, a glue with a clear finish. They, it, it does come in, uh, in black as well if you like using black, but I think I'm gonna stick to this one. I have used the black one. Um, I think the black one is better for when things get messy. Um, this clear one, when it clears up, you can kind of see that there's glue um, at the end of the, the lash, like at the tip, the knot at the end of the lash. Um, but I think I still prefer this one and then the black one you will also need a small mirror just so that you can see closely under your lash line when you are placing your lashes I have now switched over the audio to a voiceover as you can hear 
I like putting some of the products on my hand as you can see. I don't put a lot of products because this glue does dry up very quickly. After this, I dip the knot end of the individual lash onto the glue and then I apply it at like literally in the middle of my lash line, like the middle part and then I work towards the outer corner of my eye. So this is just me applying the lash properly, as you can see, but I like working towards the outer corner of my eye. So this is me just picking up one individual lash well, an individual lash and then just applying it on the outer corner of my eye. As you can see here, I have worked towards the outer corner of my eye and the inner corner I will leave to use the medium length individual lashes. So the outer corner of my eyes, I use the long ones and then the inner corners I will use the medium length of those individual lashes. Now I am done with my right eye and as you can see it looks really nice but underneath I want you to see that the gaps between each individual lash is not too big, it is just enough. So I am now done with my right eye. As you can see, I really, really love it. I love how it looks. And But most importantly, I just want to show you why I chose two packets. This is one packet. And you can already see... Oh gosh, some of them are falling off. Oh wow. But you can already see that there's not enough for the other eye. You can already see that there's not, not enough for the other eye. And that is why I bought two packets because I want to use the long ones even also on my left eye. On my left eye, I will literally be repeating the same process, starting with the middle um, of my lash line, working towards the outer corner. And obviously while I am doing this, I am using the long individual lashes. Now I will be using the medium length individual lashes for the inner corners of my eyes. So this is how they look um, now that I'm done on both eyes, both the left and the right eye. This is how the lashes turned out. I hope you did enjoy this video. Let me know what you think and please make sure you like, comment and subscribe.